friends and welcome back to the happy power channel today's date is 10 for 2021 and today we have for you guys our dude is fresh everything new in the past 24 hours and today's video actually features tons of stuff for four nightmares in 2021 and included with that actually will be a brand new collaboration with frankenstein aka frankenstein's monster for those who actually care about that uh but let's hop directly into it and first things up is actually coming directly from hypex who said this about the brand new achievements coming soon to the epic Games store epic games achievements are launching next week here are the epic achievement tiers and the amount of additional xp you can get from the achievements uh bronze 5 to 45 xp silver 50 to 95 xp gold 100 to 200 xp platinum to 250 xp and of course, there's tons of more info down in the description down below. I don't really feel the need to go over everything, but I actually have a question for you guys, and that is, uh, it doesn't really mention Fortnite on here, so I wonder if one day Fortnite will also get these achievements to get some free XP, possibly V-Bucks, and bonuses uh, in the Fortnite community. So, leave your comments down below. Did you guys notice that it did not say Fortnite, and why do you guys think that's so? It definitely says Rocket League and a few other major titles, but Fortnite seems to be left out. So again, leave your comments down below and your theories as far as why. We also have for you guys this from FireMonkey, which by the way, congratulations to FireMonkey on getting verified over on Twitter. One of the first big leakers to finally get verified. So hopefully your boy is actually next. The DreamHack Online Open featuring Fortnite tournaments have begun to get added into the API. Uh, main info, duos, October 7th, 8th, 9th, and 10th. Open qualifiers with 500 duo advancing from each heat to the semifinals. Uh, each duo can play a maximum of 10 games during the 3 hour heat. Some additional info, main info part 2, semis with 500 to 1500 duos and 50 duos advancing to the grind final. Each duo can play a maximum of 10 games during the 3 hour heat. Grand finals with 6 consecutive games at the scheduled times, a uh, new game starts every 35 minutes. And of course, he also said the Community Focus Tournaments features a $200,000 prize pool up for grabs. Best of luck. And yeah, so good luck to you guys when this officially goes live. In other news, we also have for you guys some exciting information regarding Donald Mustard and of course some brand new Fortnite Batman skins. Donald Mustard will present at the DC Fandom on October 16th. And Firemonkey added to this, he said, The Batman X Fortnite one-shot slash foundation comic first issues releases uh, in 22 days. So over on October 16th. So that actually sounds extremely exciting. I cannot wait to see what Epic Games has in store for us. And of course, the storyline uh, as far as Batman and Fortnite. As we all know, the previous comic book series uh, kind of fell along within Fortnite as far as map changes and the skins inside the comic book came to Fortnite around the time the official comic book came out uh, to the public. So we could be seeing uh, the Batman Who Laughs, the Riddler, and the Penguin coming very, very soon. So yeah, guys, leave your comments down below. What are you guys most looking forward to and what skin do you guys think will be featured in the brand new series of the comic book with Batman? And last but not least for our kind of miscellaneous section, which of course is smaller topics, as a friendly reminder, you still have the opportunity to get the Fortnite X Monopoly collaboration, aka the Collector's Edition, to acclaim uh, these amazing back blinks. So these six back blinks will be claimable only through the Fortnite X Monopoly collaboration first, but it will also become an item shop at a later date for kind of around the same price. So if you really like Monopoly or you guys want to actually get the back blinks early and fast, well, click the link in the description down below and pre-order it from GameStop. And for those who outside the U.S. honestly, unfortunately, do not know how you can pre-order it, but I do suggest you guys Google it uh, in your country. Uh, but into our next topic, uh, we actually have for you guys some pretty exciting news from Shinna. Apparently, some kind of futuristic battle bus is getting built at the Universal Studios in Hollywood. I wonder what it's all about. So yeah, we just noticed that a few people who were attending the Universal Studios in Hollywood, uh, they just noticed that the Battle Bus has now made its appearance, and it looks a lot different than the current Battle Bus. It has a futuristic look, and it possibly has a look for Ford Nightmares. And we can also note in the top left-hand corner, well, we can see Frankenstein outside of the massive Universal Cinema. So there's two theories right now in the Fortnite community. One, this is actually for their Halloween event uh, in actual Universal Studios, but also it's actually for Fortnite Mayor, so kind of a teaser. And two, going along with that, it could be for a Fortnite movie, which honestly, probably not gonna happen. 
So I'm kind of going back to theory number one for now. So theory number one, again, is actually this could be for Fortnite Mares in our game, but in real life, it's actually for their Halloween event for Universal Studios. And to top things off, they're actually celebrating well Frankenstein. So what better way to uh, actually bring the Battle Bus here and celebrate Frankenstein than to make it a real life skin in Fortnite. So that's kind of where we're currently at right now. We do speculate this is actually a massive teaser for Frankenstein making his appearance in Fortnite Mares in 2021. And to kind of back this up, we also have for you guys this in the background video. Update to last week's Frankenstein post. Universal is building a prop battle bus in their Hollywood theme park. This may mean that one of the encrypted alphas this season is their 1930s version of Frankenstein's monster. And there you guys have it. So Frankenstein is likely coming out very, very soon as far as Fortnite Mares. And speaking of four nightmares, we have for you guys tons and tons of info. So here's some great stuff in the background video. A new brandy concept coming directly from Denny, who of course actually made the dark snowbell outfit. Uh, so it actually looks pretty dang fantastic. I must say a very beautiful concept. And we also have for you guys some more concepts. And this one's actually from Lonnie. So again, very, very fantastic. Very professionally made. I must say this looks like an Epic Games official artwork, especially. And last but not least, we also have for you guys something from Pine, who of course has made, instead of a minty outfit, uh, actually, I guess a pumpkin minty outfit. So very, very fantastic stuff overall. Uh, the Fortnite community is so amazing, I must say. And also, last but not least, here's the current list of all the returning Ford Nightmare skins that have not returned just yet. So we have quite the big list so far, and hopefully we see some of these skins returning with some new skins. So of this list, what skin are you guys most looking forward to seeing back in the Fortnite item shop? Into the next topic, some more info about some four nightmares, uh, I guess brand new items. I think our work on adding a portable sideways item. Port a portal. Uh, when thrown, it will create a sideways bubble. Similar to the Storm Flip bottle, currently a placeholder too. Likely future update, but it's still unfinished. So that honestly kind of seems overpowered. You guys can throw this at somebody, and then from that point on, they'll be stuck inside, well, the sideways. So yeah, very, very cool stuff overall. Should be a very exciting update. Uh, as a friendly reminder, in case you guys missed this, adding to Shadow Battle's tweet yesterday, yes, Epic is planning to add a funding option for the mechs at the end of Season 8. But they also did this. Mechs will now have robotic vocal cords effect for voice chat. Emote props now have a proper size. Mechs can now float on the water and better charging effects. So there's gonna be a lot of updates coming to the max very very soon and in case you guys actually want to see a full dedicated video revolving around these new abilities and actually effects click this video over in my description and now finally speaking coming directly from it's hexa he actually made a brand new concept from squid game and it actually looks so so professional i mean honestly if someone's seen this they'd probably think it's completely legit which personally speaking when i first seen this i was like wow it is actually completely real until i seen who it was actually made by so big shout out to actually uh, it's Hexa for actually making this. It looks absolutely fantastic. And I definitely wanted to share it in today's video. And they also, in case you guys actually want to play a uh, squid game in Fortnite, it looks like a guy named uh, Shin Noob Gaming actually made a brand new LTM revolving around it. So it's actually called Squid Game uh, Red and Green Final Version. And of course, the code is on the very top hand corner. So yeah, guys, that's all I have for you guys for this particular video. If you want to support the channel in the best and easiest ways possible, uh, like the video, be subscribed, and we hope to see you guys in the next upcoming video. Stay happy, my friends. Hey, I'm kind of glad you didn't pick up. I kind of just called to hear your voice. I miss you. I've been thinking about you, and I've been thinking about our love how much I miss you. I miss you, and I just thought of you.